Or she, she kissed, kissed a girl. girl. She, she kissed a girl. And call it or something. Where's your Seven. phone? Wait, should we call you her? You do it. No, I'm, I'm not phone. doing it. Wait, where's my phone? Hey, Siri, call. Coming up on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills After Show. Would you ever date a woman? I think she's kind of like fighting inner demons. Was she planning a seed? Was she checking to see what we would think of it? I'm not judging anything. That's the best thing I've heard you say on that. It's appropriate for husbands when it comes to communicating with other women on social media. I've had like a fight with mom over that. I hate that. So. Don't even have me Listen, check those DMs. Hi, Sharon! Yes, 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 it was, <laughs> this is not in yeah. Hello. <laughs> Dun, da, da, da. I didn't know what scissoring was. It was on um, that cartoon show. I don't think scissoring was on the cartoon show. Yes, it was. The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills After Show starts right now. Kyla, lunch in Ojai, you had a question for the ladies. <laughs> Would you ever date a woman? She sure did us, didn't she? Holy shit. It definitely came out of left field. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Oh. This is so cute, you guys. Would you ever date a woman? Would I? Uh, you know what? Two reasons I said that. A, for shock value. B, because I am at a place in my life where I'm just like, I don't know. I have zero judgment. Do you think I would ever get a tattoo before? So I was like, who am I to say? I don't know. That's my I'm God. not judging anything. Like, who knows? Whatever. That's the best thing I've heard you say all day. At the time, it was very meaningless to me. I just thought it was one of those provocative questions that we ask each other, you know, like for fun. Um, but... And now I'm like, oh, maybe she's curious other people's perspective. Was she planning a seed? Was she checking to see what we would think of it? I think she's kind of like fighting inner demons. So I think in asking that question, she's kind of putting out feelers to her friends. Uh, like, you know? are we safe territory? Yeah. Would we be okay with it mm -hmm. if she decided, you know, to yeah. love someone else? Yeah. Did Discovering get... everything clean and starting, you know, from sort of scratch of my own beliefs and, you know, and I'm just a lot more open-minded about a lot of things across the board. Good for you. And my girl was saying to me, like, Mom, I can't believe you got tattoos. I love this new, like, you know, enlightened, you know, open-minded version of you. And whatever you need to do or however, whatever this is, this time in your life that makes you happy, whether it's dating women, not dating women, that's you. And you need to feel good about what you're doing. And whether you stay with Mauricio, don't stay with Mauricio, whatever you guys work out, it's really between the two of you. You deserve to make yourself happy. You've been through enough. Just... Live your life. It's fine. That's how I feel about it. I've been with a woman. I think it's great to have had that experience, but I don't think it's for me. I really like penises. That's how I feel. You know, that's just where I'm at. I probably would do something on the other side of that. What's that? More penis. <laughs> if I had to answer it today, I'd say maybe. I don't think I could say a hard no. Obviously, if I wasn't with PK. You're I know Dorit's been with a girl. She admitted it. Oh! Doree says maybe. Doree said maybe and she already said she's been. Or well, she, she kissed, kissed a girl. girl. She, she kissed a girl. And call it or something. Where's your Seven. phone? Wait, she call You her? do it. No, I'm phone. not doing Wait, it. Wait, where's my phone? I'm already at bad it, lab place phone? with it. Hey Siri, call Doree Kemsley. Hey Siri. Hi, this is Doree. Oh, God. Have her Dorit. call. Just say Doree, call it. Call me when you can. No, actually call me fast. <laughs> I love men. Yeah. But I, I mean, if I fell in love with someone, I understand that too, falling in love with someone and they happen to be the same sex. This is a personal question. Yeah, and that's why I'm answering it from my point of view. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I mean, I love men and I wanna be with a man, but I could see how people fall in love with someone because of who they are, not necessarily what they're made of. But it's interesting that Kyle would bring that up. At lunch in Ojai, husband's behavior on social media comes up. I, I think Instagram is literally the worst thing for relationships. I hate it. I think it's terrible. <laughs> it's appropriate for husbands when it comes to communicating with other women on social media. I had like a fight with mom over that. I hate that. So. No. Yeah, I like, that's cool. Liking people's photos. Yeah, you know, no. Following people. Too bad now I throw mom under the bus. <laughs> It's okay, honey. Like, six months ago, I was like, I don't know. I mean, it's kind of annoying now. I'm like, yeah, you know what? And you know what else? Honey, you Don't even so, have me listen, check those you DMs. you are very spicy on the first episode. I don't feel like I have to answer to anybody. Well, you don't, but don't become a rebellious person and do it out of rebellion. Do it because you want it. Listen, I am very clear right now. I'm not rebelling. 
I'm just really clear. That was like, oh. Yeah, because that's oh. right after one of those Instagram I, <laughs> situations. I was like, my girl <laughs> is pissed. And poor thing, he was just. <laughs> I think perhaps Mauricio is. Likes some pictures. Yeah. You don't have to follow every single person and like all their mm. photos. But yeah, no, I don't like that at all. I wish I was the kind of person that could just laugh that type of thing off and be like, oh, look at you. But I don't. And not only is it, does it feel disrespectful, but it also is like we're in the public eye and people can see who you follow and comment. You know, you're really disrespecting your spouse in a public forum. And that's like even worse. <laughs> that's even worse. Mo certainly knows that his wife would not tolerate him engaging with younger, attractive women on social media. There might be another couple that the wife would not mind at all. If Marcel's wanted to look at beautiful women on Instagram, we don't have rules per se, but I also don't have trust issues. My husband is the one who, when we first started dating, we would go places and he would be like, oh, um, honey, I slept with her before. So it's like, if you like somebody's picture and I know it's so-and-so that you used to date in 2003, I, why would I be upset about that? I already know that you used to date her. Me and ourselves are different though. We have the horrible conversations. We have the worst conversations. Like we talk about the worst stuff. Like people always want it like rainbows and butterflies and like, Husband, tell me, like, like eight and a half. Marcellus calls me eight and a half, and you're like, how does that make you feel? I'm like, great, it's a badge of honor. Like, I, and I, it's so funny, because I asked so many of my girlfriends that. I'm like, what would you do if your husband said you were eight and a half? Oh my God, I, I'd be so upset, and I'd divorce him. And I'd be, I'm like, why? Like, like, I'm not that woman. Like, I don't need, like, don't lie to me. Like, keep it real. That's, that's why I trust my husband, because he always is real with me. He's not going to call me a 10, because I'm not a 10. Like, right? So why would I ever think he's lying? Because he tells me all the bad stuff, right? I'm not talking about like, if Mo's liking your photos on Instagram or says something, that's totally different. Yeah. I'm, it's, I'm talking about something that doesn't, that's doesn't make really unnecessary. Sense. Right. And makes me want to grow a horn and a tail and kill people. It happens. <laughs> it happens. That's why I was so glad I was married to someone much older. Didn't even know what social media was. Didn't didn't help much, but you know there wasn't that. Lucky. Yeah. Well, she got <laughs> over in a lot of other ways.